what is up you guys it's your girl dualu and i'm back on a tool ready to tap into truth as you can see from this video today vi ah, today's video is going to be my baptism story you guys i got baptized august 25th of this year today is september 5th that i'm recording this video and i just think <laughs> i don't want to say it's ironic because i know it was all god ordained and the reason why i wanted to get baptized or why i was kind of pressing for it is because i just really wanted to to I feel like my baptism was just solidifying the deal. You know what I mean? Baptism is a symbolization of, a, some, I keep saying symbolization. It symbolizes what has already occurred in the spiritual realm and the natural. So when you get baptized, you are publicly, you know, um, declaring a, a decision you made privately, right? So you already confess with your with your mouth and you believe with your heart that Jesus is Christ the Lord. Me, I definitely did that privately. I did it in the actually in the comfort of my own home. I was not in the church when I first accepted the Lord into my life. I'll tell my testimony later, whatever. I was in the comfort of my own home. And basically what baptism symbolizes is just regeneration and purification. And um it also symbolizes like the death to sin, the burial of your old life, and the res 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 resurre <laughs> resurrection to be able to walk into the newness of Christ Jesus. You know what I'm saying? So when you go under the water, you're saying, I completely died to my old man. When you go under the water, you die to the, the ways that you used to live in your old life, the way that you used to think, how you used to do various things in your life and I was really pressing to get baptized before I went back to school and I just thank God that he allowed that to happen because um it, it literally worked out perfectly even though I miss because I'm at a Baptist church and before you get baptized you have to take courses right so I joined the course and then the first week the week after the course started for me but i missed that course because i went to the woman evolve conference so i ended up coming back and then consecutively i went every sunday to the course but it's still lined up for when they did their baptism so i just thank god for that because i really wanted to do it before i went back to school and i ended up getting baptized august 25th the day before classes started i didn't i don't have classes the, the 26th i have them the 27th whatever but still the way that it worked out was perfect and um it wasn't really an emotional experience for me because like i said i already was taking this thing serious like i was already ready like you know doing this thing with god but it, it just really was me putting the icing on the cake me already like the cake was already made i just wanted to slap the icing over it to solidify and you know go out there so why do people baptize y'all i just wanted to read a few scriptures and why baptism is important and what it symbolizes from the word of god so this is uh first peter verse chapter 3 verse 21 and the water symbolizes baptism that now saves you also not the removal of dirt from the body but the pledge of a clear conscience towards god it saves you by the rest resurrection sorry of christ jesus this is niv why do we baptize Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. That was Matthew 28, verse 19 through 20. He said, go and make disciples of all nations, not disciples of just America, not disciples of just Africa, not just disciples of Asia, disciples of all nations, all nations, all creeds, all cultures, all cultures. So in Christ Jesus, you are children of God through faith. For all of you who were baptized in Christ have clothed yourself with Christ. Galatians chapter 3 verse 27. 26 through 27 NIV when you when you baptize you become clothed with Christ not saying before your baptism you aren't but when you go under and you publicly declare and you die to your old man you are clothed with Christ you're solidified with it you know what I'm saying so that's when things really get real and you might experience some attacks and you might experience 
uh, your walk getting a little bit harder or your sh your faith being shaken up a bit but that's to be expected you know warfare is normal we need to normalize that we just need to equip our saints to know how to fight spiritually you know what i'm saying so i just wanted to come up here and share my baptism story i will insert the clips from the actual baptism and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you have any questions please leave them below and yeah just be blessed y'all Baptism is just letting the world know what Christ has already done on the inside. So I'm going to ask the two candidates to stand. Yes, yes, yes.
because they accepted you as their yes. Lord and Savior. Yes. In Jesus Christ we pray. Amen. 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 faithful God will always be with you and God loves you I don't care if you're a black a backsliding Christian I don't care if you're someone who's new to the faith or or, or you don't even know anything about Christianity and what it means to walk with Christ this isn't, this isn't about religion and I need to stop saying that this isn't about uh, uh, following rules this is about relationship this is about relationship and um, it's for everyone, you know, and I just hope that my baptism story in, in one way or another, even though it's short, I'm not going in, I'm not telling my testimony, but I'm just telling you my baptism experience. I hope in some way it convicts you and makes you want to start living right. Or, or to find more about this journey and if you find this interesting please subscribe to my channel i will be doing more faith-based videos and if you have any questions please comment below as always be blessed and peace shalom shalom <laughs>